Hi yogis, I am chiming in. I wanted to do a super quick tutorial on doorway handstands. So number one, be really careful. Anytime you go upside down, anytime your feet are not on the ground, be careful. Number two, this isn't gonna work for everybody. So if you're really tall or um, have really long legs, this might not work for your anatomy. Um, I would say 5'8", five 5'7", five is like the max height for this to really work unless you're super flexible. Um, but give it a try, try it and see. Like sometimes you'll surprise yourself. Sometimes you'll realize, okay, that's just not really gonna work for me and that's okay. Here goes. You're gonna bring your hands on either side of the door frame um, a little bit inside of the lip of the edge of the door, okay? Your back is gonna face the door, your front is gonna face the other side of the door frame. When you bring your hands down, you wanna make sure that, so essentially in handstand, your hands become your feet. So you wanna make sure your hands are nice and wide, where they're plugged in and your arms are pretty much activated, okay? Um, I'll show it to you. So. You're gonna bring your hands down either side of the frame. Your back is towards the door. Your um, your hands shouldn't be like into the frame. You want them in, in the hole of the door frame, okay? So when you set them down, look down shoulder width apart. You're gonna tuck your neck, tuck, tuck your head, bring your neck and upper back up against the door. So lean into the frame of the door and then simply walk your feet up the frame. And then what you can do is maybe hug the door frame, or you can start playing on with your balance by bringing your feet inside the door frame. Press deeply with your hands, and then to come out, you can walk down the door frame and roll up nice and slow so you don't get dizzy. Um, Give it a whirl. Let me know how it goes.